So Bodhi and I, we just got here. Uh, pretty empty. Just three dogs. Kane Corso, the boxer, uh, Marcellus. I believe that's... Is that Marcellus? No, that's not Marcellus. Okay, never mind. Wrong boxer. And uh, Bodhi, of course. So just three dogs right now. Yeah, I mistook that dog. Bodhi! Bodhi! Bodhi, hey, come on! Come on, get it! Good boy, Bodhi. Well, you didn't bring it back, though. So I hope everyone watching that you guys are doing well. Oh, man. Okay, I got to clean up after Bodhi, so be right back. Good girl. It's your friend. It's your buddy. Hey, Digger. Hey. Hey. Immediately he comes to be pet, petted by me. Nice to see you, Digger. Nice to see you. Are you doing okay, Digger? You weren't abused this weekend at the sheep farm, were you? No. He went to the beach. Oh, what, was he herding crabs or what? No. <laughs> How are you doing, Angel? Good, how are you? All right. You left at a good time yesterday, Jeff. I did? What happened? You left at a good time yesterday. Oh, why? What happened? Oh, I mean, uh, a lot of people were here and then uh, the rain came. It just uh, popped out of nowhere. Wait, 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 wait. Yesterday? Yeah. Yes, yeah. I didn't see you yesterday, but I, I was you. here. I saw you. I was in the... Uh, I was in the big field. My oh, really? My sister lives by the mountains. She probably said it's raining. It'll be there in like a minute. Yeah. I'm sure to have it lightning in it. Yeah, yeah. Digger, you just want me to I pet you, huh? Yeah. 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 You call it Duma? Duma. Hey. So you guys didn't hurt this weekend? No. No. Went to the oh. Well, you you didn't wake up at 5 a.m. to go hurting. I did, and I was hungover too, but I still woke up. And then they texted me at six, like, oh, class is canceled. Oh, I see. Oh yeah, that's right. The rain, right? Yeah. Oh, I see. Oh yeah, my sister went to a Quakes game. See where Bodhi is. Bodhi! Trying to go after gophers, of course. Dog likes to crawl his, his lip, huh? You know, dog had a lip he's like an El he's like an Elvis impersonator, huh? <laughs> he's like she's, she's the same. Way. Zuma, <laughs> Zuma, get out from under the table. Zuma, you pull around with the same one. You pull right down. Get him out. You pull right down. Whatever it is, I'm about to stop doing it because. Oh, hey, hey, come on, come on! No, they don't like that little one. Come on, leave it. So what'd you guys do at the beach? Yeah. <laughs> so
So were you relieved when the classes were canceled? A little bit, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, know, you know what? But I do admire the fact that to get up at 5 a.m. Yeah. on Saturday morning to go have your dog heard. I'm sorry, I don't mean to offend anyone, but I can't do that. <laughs> I can't do that. Now, when I first got him, because he came from a house yeah. where basically he was in the backyard all the time and he had pent up energy, Bodhi. Oh, okay. So I got him at nine months. So the first thing when I got up in the morning, yeah. I would actually play fetch with him. Oh, okay. Because his energy level was just built up yeah. so high. And yeah. he would do crazy things like in the middle of the night, yeah. like around 11 p.m., 12 a.m., he would run laps around the house. Outside the house. Yeah, so it actually it sounded like a horse stampeding around the house because that's how pent up his energy was. Now she's leaving just as I bring this out. This would have uh, kept them in line. Bye, take care. So what time did you get here? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. I should have had this out already. Oh, I guess let me get the gate. Yeah, so I guess really nobody else is coming. No mystery girl. Well, yeah, the water. She went, she took the two dogs out. She said to get bagged. She's going to go get bagged. Oh, okay. Yeah. No mystery girl. The water boy isn't showing up. Yeah. I don't think Pete Jackman's going to be here. We'll see if he shows up, that means that uh, people have to stay tuned. They're like, Hugh Jackman, I want to see if he shows up to the dog park. Yeah, so we've actually got a hawk circling. Well, it was nearby, but it just disappeared behind those trees. Oh, well. There was a hawk right in my backyard. Oh, really? Yeah, uh, chasing after a squirrel. And then uh, I guess I got home, spooked this, uh, the hawk, and uh, it flew off. Oh, okay. So, oh, wow. Uh, looks about to be inside. You know what? There's a, there's a video on YouTube. I think maybe it's on, like, Inside Edition or something like that. Of a hawk that tries to take a girl's Yorkie out of her yard. <laughs> and what she do? I think she may, maybe she fights it with a broom or something like that. I think that's what happened. Cody, hey, I got your ball. Come on. 
Ready? Hey, you gonna sit for me? Good boy. Ready? Get it. Bring it back, Bodie. Come on, Bodie. Let's go, Bodie. Good boy, Bodie. All right, where's the ball? Oh, it's right there. Maybe later with the rope toy. You know what? He he wore out my arm and my shoulder last week. So, so yeah, sometimes I have to do that moderation. You ready? You ready? Get it. Oh, we got too many dogs over here at the entrance. That's what I think. Too many dogs in the entrance. You bringing it back, Bodie? Come on, Bodie. Good boy. <laughs> hey, sit. Ready? Ready, Bodie? Wait for the dogs to clear. Get it. Good boy, Bodie. Good boy. Good question. I guess they left. Uh. Oh, oh my oh. gosh. Damn. Collision. Oh, I heard skulls cracking. Okay. Yeah. You know what? I've seen dogs run full speed, hit their head on that, and just keep going. Put your helmet on, on the bench. <laughs> Let a little basset hound go. <laughs> hey, down, it's not cute. Get down. Hi there. Hi. <laughs> Hi, what's your name, huh? <laughs> Getting swarmed by basset hounds. Ah.
Yeah, it's still a little bit humid out here today. Uh, yeah, something that I want to clear up, those days when I was saying that it was pretty hot out here, which it was pretty warm, but the thing is, is that I've, I'm basically, I'm a very sensitive to heat. So if the temperature is say over 83 Fahrenheit, yeah, I, I basically don't like anything over 83 Fahrenheit. And if I could, I would just be in a cool, say like 75 or below Fahrenheit every day. Even if it's like uh, high 60s or even 50s, I like that. But once you get, say, over 85 degrees Fahrenheit, maybe even just like 83 Fahrenheit, I'm not doing too well in it. That's why uh, in all those videos I was saying how hot I was and I was sweating. So, so that's what it is. Just uh, the the warm temperatures. I I just do not like it. I don't like it. Like most people, they like the vacation in the summertime. No, I'm I'm a person who likes the vacation in the fall. So, yeah, I, I just don't like the heat. Bodie, come on. Yeah, so if it was uh, really hot out here, yeah, I'm not going to have Bodhi out here running around or uh, doing vigorous exercise because I know I uh, there were some people who were concerned about that, so I just wanted to address those concerns. Like right now, it's, there's a nice breeze, but it's a little bit humid. So, yeah, if we could take away that humidity, it'd be perfect out here, wouldn't you say? Yeah. Yeah. Two liter bottle with the lid on it, then it won't smash. Oh yeah. It won't smash so easy, you know? Oh yeah, true, true, true. Put yeah, I should bring it. bring a bottle. But yeah, people here at the dog park are actually wanting to see Bodie play with the rope tour. Yeah, I don't want to see him smack that basset hound and he goes flying. <laughs> hey, no! <laughs> Zuma, are you a party pooper? Is that what you are, huh? <laughs> What happened, Bodhi? What happened? Oh, what happened? What happened? <laughs> you want somebody to try to pick it up? <laughs> What's going on, Bodhi, huh? Uh oh. No, that's not even yours. Oh my gosh, so Bodhi just stole this toy. Hey, not yours. 
Not yours, leave it, not yours. Hey, I just said it's not yours. He tried to snatch it out of my hand. No, 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 not your toy. Here you go, sorry about that. Hey, get down. No, you're not going to do it again. Bodhi, let's go this way. Let's go. Good boy. All right, Bodhi, come on. Let's go, Bodhi. Bodhi, come on this way. Let's go up. Bodhi, up. Good boy. Bodhi, go ahead, sit. No, sit. I know you're looking at that rock, but hey, sit. No. No. Stay. Okay, so that's going to put a wrap on today's video. Bodhi and I, we hope you enjoyed watching. Hopefully, we were able to capture something that you enjoyed seeing. Uh, if you can, please give the thumbs up. Also, if you aren't subscribed, please subscribe. Make sure your notification bell is on because more videos are coming soon. Also, a big thank you to everyone who watches the ads that help support Bodhi. And we appreciate it so much. And everyone, everyone who's been so kind to press the thanks button and has donated to Bodhi, we truly appreciate it from the bottom of our hearts. And before we go, we want to read off a few names of people who left comments on previous videos. Anna Matovic, Diane Spirits 2011, I think I'm saying that right, Weimaraners, Jonathan Karen Vanderwall, Adrian, Car Adrian Carter, A, aka Zeus, and Becky O. Becky O, hope, hope you and Gotti are doing well. Thank you so much for watching again and commenting. Hey, sit. Sit. Stay. And as far as a few of your comments, Anna Matovic, I hope I'm saying that right, Matovic, says, why was my comment deleted? This is the third time in the last few days. You know what, Anna Matovic, I'm not sure why that would happen. Uh, I think maybe the, uh, I have to be careful what I say, but I don't know if certain words were maybe said and somehow it got removed by some of the overseers. I'm not going to say who, got to be careful about that, but Anim Animatovic, really appreciate you watching and all your comments. So I'm so sorry that that, that has happened. Uh, Gary Tui says, it was Princess Le Leia who described Han Solo as a scruffy looking nerf herder. But respect for mentioning that piece of trivia. Gary Tui, thank you so much for clearing that up. Uh, yeah, I got the lines mixed up uh, from, I believe, maybe it's the first... Maybe it's the first Star Wars, I'm not sure, but you can clue me in on that one too. But yeah, I do believe that that one girl is studying to be a nerf herder. That's that's my theory anyhow. Uh, let's see here. Chris St. Clair says, Mr. 50 questions, almost creepy, good looking Doby. Okay, uh, Mr. 50 questions, almost creepy. I don't know, you're either creepy or you're not creepy, so you're gonna to have to choose one on that. So if you wanna call me creepy for asking the 50 questions, feel free to do so. Thank you so much for Chris uh, St. Clair watching and commenting. Re really appreciate you, thank you. Jason Biggs says, one of the most dangerous and anxious times in a dog park is when a new dog enters. You know what, I agree with that, Jason Biggs. If you wanna see what Jason Biggs is talking about, he was talking about the video, Owner Defends Dog from Vicious Attack at Dog Park. Hey, sit. Sit. So I will put a link for that video at the end of this one if you want to check that one out. It's quite remarkable what that owner did to defend his dog. So I will put a link at the end of this video. Once again, everyone, thank you so much for watching. We hope everyone, everyone is doing well, and we hope we see you on the next episode of Bodhi's World. Everyone, take care.